Meanwhile, leading up to next month's election in PA, we continue to see issues with mail-in ballots. In York County, about 400 people got duplicate mail-in ballots. And once again in Lancaster County, they're responding to a mistake. CBS 21's Elise Person was there as the Board of Elections met today. Nearly 24,000 mail-in ballots here in Lancaster County were sent out with incorrect instructions. This is now the third consecutive year the county has had issues with those mail-in ballots. So today I got in front of a county commissioner to ask how this continues to happen and how errors are being prevented in the future. I'm the chairman of the Board of Elections. Put it on me. In an effort to try and make things easier for voters, Lancaster County Board of Elections changed the color of their mail-in ballot secrecy envelope but didn't update the instructions page. As soon as we knew that it happened, we then sent out email and contacted by our direct email, by putting on our website, contacting the parties, contacting the media, going on social media, telling people that there was this error. The board on Wednesday approving a motion to allow voters who have made a mistake with their secrecy envelope the option to come in and correct that issue. This mistake just the latest in a string of issues with Lancaster County mail-in ballots. When it comes to making sure that everything is accurate, what's the process that goes into before those mail-in ballots are sent out? We're trying to verify right up to the last minute. So there's a sequence of events we go through to check that. In this case, while we spent a lot of time making sure the ballots were correct, we didn't get to this one change. I guess it, it, it was a small enough change in terms of the instruction set that it just didn't get caught. And what changes are being implemented looking towards the future to ensure that there's no more mail-in ballot challenges in upcoming elections? That's hard to say because that's under the state legislature. We, I would very much prefer the state legislature would go back and look at Act 77 and look at some of the rules and say, yes, you get three days of pre-canvassing. Or everybody's exterior envelope has to look like this across all 67 counties. We're a commonwealth. We don't do it that way. Well, let's just say that doesn't happen. Is there anything the county can do specifically to ensure no more future issues with mail-in ballots? There is no 100% answer. Everybody doesn't catch everything, no matter how often you do it. The answer of trying to say we have to get to zero is not a rational question. Lancaster County voters who believe they may have incorrectly filled out their ballot have until November 6 to come to the voter registration office to fix that ballot. They must provide identification to do just that. The last day to apply for a mail-in ballot here in Lancaster County is October 31st. In Lancaster County, Elise Person, CBS 21 News.